like a silent disco, but a silent marketing talk. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> So I'm going to be joined by Johnny from Journey Further. I'm going to talk a lot about Lick, about our journey so far, about the big projects that we did, the big tests that helped sh shaped our business. And Johnny's going to be talking in terms of the A-B tests that they worked and supported us on to optimise the site and use Journey. And I'm going to be talking about how you try and systematise the process of trial and error into something that you can apply to other businesses, which is what we do. We, we run experimentation programs, which are the systematization of the process of discovery that you find in science. Everything great that's ever really happened in modern civilization has come about from the scientific method. And it's amazing to me that businesses don't try and emulate that and replicate that. Mm. Instead, you know, sit around in offices going, oh, we don't need to test anything. I've worked in this industry for 20 years. I know exactly what works. Um, but it doesn't, and science does work. So why are businesses not trying to emulate that? That's really the, that's, I mean, that's what this talk is about, but it's also my passion and the thing that sort of drive, driven my whole career, really. Personal brand manager, Katie, you've got to be happy with... I know. This. I mean, you set all this up. Not I know, well, not the whole event, <laughs> I wish. Um, yeah, no, it's exciting to kind of see it all come to life. Like, I've been working on this since, like, January, from, like, very fast, like, conversations to now, so it's exciting. Mm. What's your go-to uh, networking style? Oh, uh, that's a good question. Is it where the brightest coat? Yeah, that's it, that's <laughs> it. Make yourself stand out. <laughs> It's actually in the setup, so it's about getting in touch with people pre-event, okay. figuring out why they're there, what they potentially might want to talk about, and then, yeah, finding them at the event and having a good chat with them. It's the plan. What the lead case study is trying to show is how we integrate experimentation with business strategy, and that is quite different from the way most people do it. Most people just come up with a ton of ideas and churn through them and see what works. The key is that you know we're learning simple things from experimentation but then always trying to say what does that, what could that mean for the business as a whole. It can mean so many things so you know for me as a CEO and our management team it's much more on a macro level. Should we go into Europe, which market should we focus on? What verticals should we go on? You know, these can really, or what channels, these can really define the business and business direction and shape the business, and it has for us in particular. And likewise, with the work we've done with Journey Further, to optimize the user experience to really solve the customer problem, uh, you know, it really shapes the business, and you've got to keep innovating, keep pushing forward, and, and A B testing throughout that is a massive part of it. Finally, if anybody watching this wants to get in contact with yourselves, how do they do this? LinkedIn, I'm always active on LinkedIn, or just get in touch through our website, but yeah, you'll, you'll easily find me on LinkedIn, and I'm always very happy to have conversations about any of this stuff, whether or not it turns into sales, I'm, I don't really care, I just love talking to people about it, so.